He's worked with some of the biggest names in pop and helped New Zealander Daniel Bedingfield recover his voice following serious car crash. Dave Stroud was in the country over the weekend giving his educated opinion on some of our singers. Elliot Crum came under his guidance. For over 20 years now, Dave Stroud has been a sort of personal trainer for The Voice, so he knows someone special when he hears them. When somebody communicates art and it gives you chills, whether it's acting, painting, singing, that's what it's all about. Like to be everything you want. He's worked with Justin Bieber early in his career, but according to Dave, raw talent only gets you so far. I have remarkable voices come through my studio. Uh, probably three or four a week. And so why this one went bam and the others have not have a lot to do with a lot of other things. Perhaps hoping to discover a Justin Bieber for balding men beaten down by life, Dave insisted on listening to my instrument. In fact, it is living in your mistakes that make you good, not living in all the good things you've done. Oh, well, that's good. Right? I'm living in a lot of mistakes with my singing at the moment. <laughs> but you live there, and it doesn't take long for that to grow and change. According to Dave, this is the next big thing he's working with in this part of the world, Australian 14-year-old Jordan Jansen. Really great personality, and there's something magnetic about him, and kind of even the way they carry themselves is interesting. And then they sing, and there's so much voice there, and you go, wow, this is really interesting. So I'm really happy he's starting to blow up. I wanted to blow up just like Jordan. Sing me a song a cappella. Show me what it's like. So thought I'd wow Dave with the song I sang at my wedding. <laughs> 